How to create an effective FAQ video. Hello! In part 2 of a series, I want to introduce a type of video that can provide a great stepping stone in your video strategy. In the marine industry, we are dealing with a lot of fairly complex products. One of the biggest challenges during the sales process is answering all the questions potential buyers may have. How many times have your sales reps answered the same questions at almost every first call? It's estimated that for most products and services, 80% of prospective buyers have the same questions. How can we streamline the process, build trust, shorten the sales cycle? Enter the FAQ video, sometimes also called the 80% video. Imagine this, before a sales meeting, the sales team sends a video addressing the five to seven most common questions of your buyers. How much more efficient and productive would that meeting be? Anticipating your prospect's questions builds trust and shows that you really know your business and the prospect's concerns inside and out. But how do we create an effective FAQ video? Start with the sales team. From the very beginning, the sales team has to be involved in the process. They are the ones who have the conversations with your prospects every day and they know the questions your prospects are asking. The first step is to get the sales team together and ask them simple questions like what are the most common questions prospects ask during the first sales appointment? Notice that we're specifying the first sales appointment. In many sales cycles there are questions that are common but come up much later in the cycle. For the purpose of the FAQ video we need the first questions. The key is to go with the questions that clients actually ask, not the ones we would hope they would ask. No matter how uncomfortable we are with answering questions like how much does this cost? Or are there any downsides to this product or service? We must address them. Our answers will be an educational opportunity for our prospects. Remember, the FAQ video is the beginning of your relationship and building trust at this stage will only strengthen the bond your prospect has with you. Make it count. Make a list of the recurring questions and prioritize them. Depending on the complexity of your product and the size of your sales team, the number of questions gathered in the initial round may vary. How do you narrow them down? One way is to consider what is going to be most helpful for your prospect to know ahead of time. For example, you might end up with four cost-related questions. Is it possible that you could address all four in a segment titled How much does it cost to work with our company? You have identified the top five to seven questions. Congratulations! Now it's time to outline the answers together. The sales team should work together to outline the answers to the questions. This ensures that each representative provides consistent answers and avoids confusion and inaccurate information. While each representative should state things in their own words, Outlining the key points to hit for each question is essential. We recommend going with a rough outline rather than a detailed script. Every salesperson brings their personal touch to the team. Everybody will answer the questions in a slightly different style and we want to keep it that way for the FAQ video. What does your sales process look like? How many steps or touch points happen in the typical sales cycle? Is it always one face to the customer? All will customers meet different salespeople throughout the cycle? How big is your sales team? We need to consider this process in detail because ideally the FAQ video mirrors this process. Depending on the answers, it may be feasible to record every salesperson individually and create individual versions of the FAQ video for every team member. If the sales force is too large for that, there could be one FAQ video for the whole team with a short one-on-one -on -one introductory video for every salesperson. For a smaller company or wherever sales is more of a team effort, you may only need one final video. The key here is to look at the salesperson to client relationship in your organization. Produce your FAQ video in-house or hire a production company. Thanks to the power of today's smartphone cameras and the easy availability of editing software, it's possible to create high-quality in-house videos. There are several benefits to producing your own videos, such as the ease of scheduling, particularly when filming a larger sales force, and potential cost savings, especially if you have video-savvy 
team members with proven post-production skills at this level. However, even companies that create most uh, bottom-of-funnel video work themselves in-house often outsource FAQ videos to us or production companies to benefit from. Consistently great lighting and sound quality, because that impresses your potential customers with that extra sparkle. Guidance and support from experienced video producers. And don't underestimate that excitement that comes from having a real film crew present. Your sales team will be super enthused and give their very best on that shooting day. The size of your market also plays a role. If you conservatively estimate that a professionally produced video will result in, say, 10% bigger sales boost than an in-house product, it's easy to figure out at what point it's worth it to involve a video production company. In conclusion, an FAQ video is a powerful tool that can help answer your prospects' questions even before the first sales appointment. Creating an FAQ video can build trust with potential customers and it will shorten your sales cycle, leading to higher quality sales conversations. Thank you very much for watching and don't hesitate to get in touch with me personally with any questions or ideas. See you next time.